Google has broken its silence about the mystery barge floating in the San Francisco Bay. We now know what this is. It does belong to them. They have claimed responsibility for it. They released a statement uh, today about it, and what it basically said was it is going to be a showroom of sorts, a place where you will go and experience Google apps, software, and hardware. And that's what I think is the key behind this Google barge. It's all about the hardware that they are now making and selling gadgets. Don't forget, Google acquired Motorola, so they are making and selling Android phones. They have the Nexus 7 tablet, that's Google's tablet, to rival the iPad. They are offering a new device that just came out. It's called Chromecast. It's a $35 streaming media player that wirelessly connects to your phone, tablet, or laptop to your living room TV. I predict this device is going to be huge, and soon they will be selling Google Glass. So they are in the gadget game, but they don't have retail stores. Their main competitor, Apple, has stores, stores that are famous and iconic around the world. They look cool, and it's a place you can play with and learn about all the Apple gadgets. Google needs something like this. They need retail space, and they need to one-up Apple and make it even cooler than Apple's glass stores. So what do you have? A floating store. What's cooler than that? And here's the latest intel. This is not confirmed from Google, but from what I'm hearing, these new Google showrooms could be open in a matter of weeks, not months or years, but weeks. The idea for this holiday season. We'll see. Gabe Slate, Cron4 News.